Hi, I'm Scott Distasio from Distasio Law Firm. One of the questions people ask me is, how long does it take to resolve a car accident case? And the reality is, if any lawyer is answering that question for you when you first meet them, that lawyer really is not telling you information you need to know because it's really impossible to know at first because there's so many different variables that go into it. The first thing that has to happen is you have to gather all the evidence. And while you're gathering the evidence, the client has to treat for their medical condition. And you don't want to resolve a case until that client is at what's called maximum medical improvement. It's a medical term, but what it really means is that you're at your best. Because if you gather the evidence and submit your claim before you're at, the be at your best, you can do that in the, within a month of the crash happening. But the insurance company is always going to take the position that you are going to get better. And so they're going to offer less money. Until you're at your maximum best, no one really knows. And so in a car crash case, it usually takes treatment about four to six months before a doctor is ready to say, you're at your best. And hopefully, when that happens, you're fully recovered or almost fully recovered. And if that happens, your case is not worth as much. But many, many times, the doctor will write a report that if you haven't gotten better by this point, you're not going to, and now you're at your best, and here's what your future needs are. That, again, takes about four to six months, and when that happens, that's when we're ready to make your claim. So then we gather all the evidence, put it together, and put a package out to the insurance company and no negotiate a resolution. So the average timeline for a settlement in a, pers a car crash case is usually somewhere between uh, five and nine months for that process to take take place but sometimes the insurance company doesn't offer a reasonable settlement now you could certainly settle your case in that five to nine month period and take the money that's offered and many law firms would pressure you to do that at Distasio law firm we won't if your case is worth more than what's being offered and you want to go through the process, we're going to file a lawsuit on your behalf. Now that may slow things down because often it takes up to 18 months after a lawsuit is filed to get in front of a jury. That process of filing a lawsuit and moving through, taking depositions and getting a case ready for trial tells the insurance company you're serious and they know that the law firm is serious and that's often with some cases, the first time the insurance company will really come to the table and offer a legitimate settlement. So sometime after depositions are taken, there'll be a settlement conference for that to occur. If your case doesn't settle at Distasio Law Firm, we're prepared for the cases that are worthy of doing so to go to trial and see what a jury says. That doesn't mean your case is going to go to trial. What it means is that the insurance company knows we will take your case to trial if it deserves it and as a result they're more likely to actually settle so the reality is when there isn't enough money offered before filing suit and you file a lawsuit and move through the process just by doing that it puts a deadline and at that point the cases often settle and most cases don't go to trial I'm Scott Distasio from Distasio Law Firm, and we're here to help.